morning everyone this is Freya and Joy and as I am talking now in the previous videos videos about comfort zones and how to get out of comfort zones uh, so when I talk about these things I do it from my own experiences and one thing that is coming with the comfort zone and to get out of it. Some people do it sometimes. I was actually uh, analyzing and looking at my life and I, I have lived that always in one or the other way because I was, I was really searching, searching in all ways possible to find a way to get out of the 3D matrix for many, many years. Whoa. And here is a thing I would like to say about the comfort zones. So there is possibilities and you have to take action, conscious action. So I, I did not only say no to my main abuser, which started a real deep process with, how to say, I can say cutting off all strings attached to any, any kind of abusive person or circumstance in my life. Because the abuse on me was not only from my main abuser, it was from like groups and big, um, so to say, uh, uh, events, big, uh, yeah, we can call it groups in society that was feeling I was a threat because they wanted to stay in their. Uh, abusive behavior and uh, of course they wanted me to stay as one of their their possibilities to get energy because what what people do and groups and these groups who have these group pressures on people group pressure on people is they take your energy yeah that's the purpose the purpose of abuse is to take energy it's uh, some people call it energy thieves. Energy thieves can be very slightly and it can be big, big, uh, big abuse of taking energy. So taking uh, energy, be energy thief is a, a slightly uh, small word when it comes to abuse who can be really, really threatening. It can be absolutely life threatening uh, like it has been in my life before back in time in the past which I get out of I get out of then you have to erase all the things so to say that are so to say strings attached to behaviors in your life that are behaviors in your life that are holding up these structures that could abuse you. So, when I go out in the world, I give out light codes and upgrade DNA. I also simultaneously work on the deepest level, not only on myself. I do it on the whole uh, subconscious, unconscious of the whole humanity. As I am a psychic and a medium, I work on very deep level, not only for myself. When I do for myself, I do it for everyone else. And uh, so, I do then two things more when I'm out traveling in the world. One is, I am also uh, looking for a new place to stay in the world. I don't know when I'm going to find it or where, uh, but I can see slowly how things are evolving 
and sometimes I don't see anything and then suddenly I can see okay that's why this happened that's why that happened and I see actually I saw one day ago that is evolving in perfect timing and it's evolving in a good way a good way that actually shows that the things I would love to have in my life is slowly manifesting from inside out and this is why for me sometimes it is hard because I don't see on the outside so much of exactly what I would like to manifest uh, of course I love to travel I am on beautiful places all the time but I have of course a lot of challenges but the, the things I really want to manifest is something else but it's coming from inside it comes from inside out and I could see actually one day ago that yeah what is happening is that these patterns inside are changing in a very good very good way the other thing here is that the comfort zone patterns as I talked about the previous in the previous video that these comfort zones the, it sounds like it's something comfort zone low sounds like it's something nice it's not always I mean it can be, like I said in my previous video, a system of, of things you have arranged around you to survive uh, 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 to different parts of events and things that happen in your life. And this is actually happened to each and every human being on earth in one or the other way. But then I so okay very good clearly this is also what i'm doing i'm doing it consciously but periods i forget about things i did begin consciously because i'm going so deep into solve and cut cords to different things different situations and circumstances in my life so uh, that is the thing that when you live in a place like when I stay well I when I was in Sweden I had my house or my apartment I of course you do some things like nearly every day you have to go into your house and out of your house you have to buy this food you have to clean you have to do this and that that comes with to have a house or an apartment on one place and that's one of the things I am breaking those patterns because I don't stay long time sometimes three weeks but then I go through deep things and then I leave to next place I stay for a while and then I go to next place so I'm soon about to leave this place now too and this is always a process it's a process because it's like starting anew and letting go and it's always new things to let go of. I tell you this because I want you to remember when you go into this process yourself what I tell you now so don't give up set up your goals that's the most important then you can go deeper and you can cord cut the cord cutting is not just what you do in the area where you decide I'm gonna cut cord with this person or situation it comes with all the patterns that are around that person or situation also it is a lot of other things you also have to change to stop maybe doing and put in to do something new that is more benefiting for what you really would love to have in your life so good luck good luck and i hope <laughs> you could hear me because i am on my way here to uh, i actually gonna work on some uh, papers cv but uh, i i didn't have uh, found in my uh, 
in the hard drive uh, because I didn't have that program in my latest laptop so uh, I had to work out some new because of the situation here but so yeah so this traffic is actually Pacific Highway Pacific Highway up here so the traffic is hard I hope you hear what I say have a nice day blessings all of you for me for enjoy in beautiful Australia